Connor, FA Cup action this weekend, but first, just to reflect on last weekend, a, a fantastic comeback at Dorkin. Yeah, brilliant result. Um, if you look at the last week, last minute winner here against Fylde, and to go, come from two goals down at half time against Dorkin is obviously two massive results uh, in order to keep on the tails of Chesterfield as best we can. Obviously, with it being FA Cup this week, it's a good time just to reflect on the first sort of quarter of the season. 35 points, 32 goals, second in the table, an excellent start to the season. Yeah, it's been brilliant. Um, as I said, yeah, the, the point return is outstanding, but I think along with that, the performances the majority of games have been excellent as well, which obviously shows that hopefully it's sustainable what we're doing. We can carry on, keep doing it for the rest of the season. But yeah, brilliant start. Obviously, Chesterfield have set an unbelievable pace and to be within three points of them is obviously an excellent achievement. We've got to keep going and keep pushing them. Um, we feel like we can go all the way. So we'll, we'll try our best to keep on plugging away game by game. So as I said, we're on to the FA Cup this weekend and we, we put the league to rest for, for a week or so. Obviously, the teams who do tend to get promotion at the end of the season, you've got a grind out result. Uh, four wins on the bounce and three of those games come back from behind to get the points. It shows a great mentality of the group. Yeah, listen, even Man City, there's no team in the country or in the world that they can win comfortably and it'd be pretty every game. So you've got to find a way to win. I think you see that with any team that goes and achieves success. They, they tend to find a way in, in a lot of games throughout the season. And we're doing that at the minute. Uh, a lot of games, the last, I think, I'm not sure if the last four or three, the last four have been by one goal as well or, or what the stats are on it, but I feel like they're in tight games that we've come out on top on, which is which is a really good sign for us. Nicky Caban, we've got a, a landmark goal on Saturday, his 30th for the club. Well, he's been a fantastic player for us. Brilliant. Um, to be honest, he's, he's even upped his levels from last year this season. We feel he's de doing even better than what he was doing last year. I know his goal return at this point is obviously higher than what it was last year, but just in terms of his general play, we feel he's, he's occupying defences excellently. He's doing exactly what we're asking of him. Um, and he's just to be fair, he's gone about his business brilliantly. We don't need to do much talking to him. He knows his role, he knows his jobs, and to be fair to him, he's, he's implementing that brilliantly on a Saturday and Tuesday. Obviously, attention's turned to the FA Cup now. We play Averley, got promoted to the National League South uh, last season, doing very well sixth in the league this year. We're expecting a tough test tomorrow. Yeah, 100%. They're doing brilliant, as you said. Um, obviously, promotion promotion last season, they're still riding that way. To be fair, they've started excellently in the league below. Danny Scope's doing a great job. I think they got, I think they got 19 points from 11 games, so brilliant return, sixth in the division. So they're in the playoff spots in the league below, and they deserve to be there. Watch a lot of their games, good side. Gone to Worthing and beat them 2-1, who are an excellent side as well. So we know it's going to be a tough test. They're well organised, powerful, got a lot of good players, so yeah, it'll be a very tough test on another Astro as well. And finally, any update to the team for tomorrow? Uh, we hopefully got maybe a couple of bodies coming back. Uh, we'll wait and see how they, how they get through today. Um, but yeah, we'll, probably, we'll move forward to the same group. Obviously, we managed to get the result against Dorkin with, with obviously people like Beard coming back in, which obviously helps. He's Him and Dom, I thought, done well the other day. Um, Beard was better second half than first half, but Dom, I thought Dom done well when he came on as well. They both look fit and powerful. That's the whole reason for long. They've gone and got match fitness and then they come back ready to go. So fair play to them too. It's good to have them back. Connor, thank you for your time. Thank you.